What's good, guys? I'm back with another video. Today, I'm joined by my friend Aurel. Um, we are going to try natto together. It's natto is a Japanese. Uh, oh, so Aurel doesn't know what natto is. So now I can finally reveal it. It's fermented beans. Okay. Um, and so we have three flavors here today. The first one is daikon. Uh, daikon, which is like a Japanese radish. Second one is. Omuboshu plum, which is uh, supposed to be sour, tart, and then the last one, I'm trying to get a good image here, there we go, is uh, it's supposed to be like a natural, like a less potent uh, version of natto, because as people know, natto is a little, has a kind of a scent to it. So yeah, we are just going to start with, I guess the more basic one, daikon. Okay, so I learned this trick through watching various TikToks and whatever. You like pop it through like that, I guess, and then does this work? All right, and then pop a hole through the corner, and you pull out the sheet, and it is sticky. It, it kind of worked. Okay, so I'm gonna make a mess, but that's fine. Now we take the seasoning, which is daikon. Mix it in. Should we have grabbed a bucket? Ah, uh, hey, 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 <laughs> respectful! No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be okay. Okay. I'm gonna plug up the hole that I made here, and I'm just gonna start. You see, you see it here? All right, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna start mixing it up. I'm not sure if the camera can catch that. And as you mix it up, it becomes more like a mucus. Aurel is uh, yeah. yeah. This is gonna taste so great. Appetizing. This is gonna taste great. We have to enter this. And I see like Japanese people, like they, they go hard with it, so I'm just gonna. It's really no odor to it. That's not like yeah, I mean, my, my nose has been blocked for a year, so I can't tell anything. <laughs> Got something to coke. Just kidding. Okay, um, now I'm going to, like, I guess I'm just gonna put some onto your ball. Like, half of it onto your ball. And then I'll do half onto mine. Oh, goodness. Ball of rice. Okay. So, you know, for me, whenever I'm taste testing things, Look, if I'm going to try something, I'm going to try it. And also, guys, you're probably going to see me drink a lot of water during this. Uh, I can't... I can't swallow food without water. It's weird. Anyways. So, you can see, turn my plate around. We have three balls of rice for the three flavors. Anyways, so try and get a little bit of rice in with it. And, uh... Take your time. Aurel isn't familiar with chopsticks, so forgive him, but all good. You ready, bro? It's just once you grab it, shove it in your mouth. Push okay, go. <laughs> <laughs> go. Cheers. Ah. Uh. Cheers. Very good. Mmm. 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 Japan. I'm enjoying this with some friends. Yeah, that takes a lot of imagination. <laughs> Sending out. It's, it's not bad. It's actually not bad. It's, it's definitely an acquired taste, and I'm a very open-minded person when it comes to food. Um, my friend says it's going to taste way better with like an egg and salt, like a raw egg and salt. Mm -hmm. I can see that. But, yeah, it's... Um, Definitely a slimy texture, as you can expect, yeah. but... It weirdly reminds me a little bit of Rice Krispies. <laughs> They're really <laughs> soft and soft. Yeah, <laughs> I guess so. Okay, sure, sure. Go okay. back. Not bad, right? You yeah. me going in more. Yeah, see? Okay, that was pretty good. Daikon flavor. We will finish this, like, off camera, don't worry, but gotta move on for the video, keeping it short. 
or as short as we can. This one is plum, which I'm actually excited for. I, I really like omoboshu plum. So same packaging, plum sauce. Okay, I'm gonna try and do it the way it's been intended, the way, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, the other way is, I think, cleaner, I don't know. Okay, whatever. Tear it, mix it in. Okay, oh wait, that's, oh, I mixed the chocolate stuff, that's fine, this one is still good to mix. Okay. okay. Mix it up. Like it looks pretty darn good before you mix it up. Once you start mixing it, the mucus somehow magically comes out, which is really weird. But I mean, it's not mucus. I should not say that. It looks like it. Boop boop boop. Okay. We're just gonna. Same old deal. The right half down the line. Oh, this is this is this is stickier. I feel. Maybe. Okay. Okay. Go over. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Do 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 do. Oh no! It's in my hand. Oh no! Oh, it's everywhere. All right. I'll leave that on top of this. Oh boy. This is what I'm actually excited for. Uh, let's go for it, bro. Cheers. Cheers, or I guess itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Oh. Oh. I'm having trouble. I feel like I like this one more. Oh my goodness, can you guys see the strands? Like, mmm. The plum one is actually pretty good. Moving on to the last one. <clears throat> this one is supposed to be less, I guess, potent, like um, less smelling, even though I don't notice any smell really. Right? Do you? <laughs> As I said. <laughs> oh, right, right, <laughs> right, right, right. But um, yeah. Or when you eat it in your mouth, any like foul, like. No, it's, it's not that strong. Yeah. I was expecting something strong. Same. Yeah. Oh, good. The arrows are pointed this way. How do I open this? Oh, there we go. Arrows lied. That's fine. Ooh, this one has uh, like hot, like mustard, hot mustard maybe. Cool. Oh my goodness, this is. Imagine trying to. I, if your friend never tried Japanese food, I wouldn't recommend this as the first thing to get them into, but. Just visually, people may not be used to it. Ooh, ooh, okay, it's like a... <clears throat> okay. That's cute little, like, tiny little packet of mustard. <clears throat> Almost spilled. Okay, we're good. Like a little drip of mustard. And then mix it up. Like, you guys see this? When it, it comes out, it looks like just regular, like, beans or something like fermented. And then, mix it up. Oh, this one is very, very liquid. Not as sticky as the other one. Okay. Cool. We'll go with the same. Oh. Do, 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 do. 
Oh goodness. Okay. The final one. This is supposed to be less potent. Let's give it a try. Feeling brave. I'm going for a big bite. I'm going for as big as I can get. Do it. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> The, even though we put in such a small packet of the hot mustard, you can really taste it coming through. Mmm. There we go. Mm. Yeah, you can definitely taste the mustard on this one. Mm -hmm. um, I would say it probably has the strongest flavor. Mm -hmm. I know it's supposed to be the less fermented one. I think it's the mustard that like yeah, it's pushes it out. Yeah. yeah. Yo, these are good though. Actually, I kind of like this. <laughs> Which one would you say was your favorite? Mmm, the plum. How about you? Um, the daikon. Mmm. So, I don't want to make the video too long. <clears throat> How long has it been going? I can't even tell. But, um, thank you, RL, for being so brave and joining me on this, like, totally blind review. Um, if you guys enjoy, we'll do more of these. I'll keep giving him weird food to eat. I'll eat more weird food, too. Um, other than that, thank you for watching. Thank you for coming. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.